Hello everyone and welcome back to another GTA Online guide where today we're going to be taking a look at the Brutus, a Mad Max style van added as part of the Arena War DLC in GTA Online. So let's take a look shall we? So for the price of 2.66 million dollars you'll get your hands on a van which can do more than its intended use. You'll see what the other use will be near the end of the video but for now, well, here's the thing, I can't really afford to buy this thing. I'm totally out of cash, so I'm going to have to ask a friendly neighbourhood subscriber to help in this matter. And yes, I'm sorry Tylerius, yes I forgot to credit them in the previous video. I'm sorry, yes I do read comments as much as you think I don't. Thanks to Ancient Irish for loaning me this machine, and also for showing me the secondary use for the thing, which I'll be showing you later. But for now, what can the van come with? Well, a fully upgraded one will come with all the usual extras that we're all used to by now in the Arena War DLC. The saw blades, the machine gun, the mines, the jumping ability, and the boost features of your choice. The van pretty much handles like a top heavy van. It accelerates slowly, turns lightly, and can get a lot of oversteer if you need it. So it's easy enough to control for when you need it most in an Arena Wars game mode. Its speed however, well, let's compare it against the ZR380 shall we? So as expected, the van was easily outmatched by a sports car, but is it a decent vehicle to use in the Arena Wars game mode? Because as a normal free mode armoured van, it's not really that good. In fact, it's rather funny, because when I was doing the armour testing, the armoured panels were not only fake, but they also had the questionable visual effect of shattered glass on steel. I don't know, maybe there's glass over the steel in that area? But even then, it didn't really do anything to protect the target inside, and pretty much everywhere else on the front is vulnerable to attack. The thing also takes only two rockets to blow up, so PvP, like pretty much every other Arena Wars vehicle, is useless. So as an Arena Wars specific vehicle, is it that good? Well, I can imagine the tall structure of the van being a big problem, as it becomes a bigger target for opponents to hit. And with just one machine gun to attack, it's not really going to hold up so well compared to the likes of the other vehicles which have at least two machine guns. And in the case of the Scarab, although it has only one machine gun, it at least makes up for it with the use of extra armour. Though one good thing that I can say about this vehicle is that when you do some shunt boosting with the thing, usually when you shunt boost in Arena Wars vehicles, it usually causes an out of control situation, but in the Brutus it seems... Okay. I don't know, it's probably just me. It seems easier for some reason. But if the only good thing that I can say about the Brutus is that its shunt boost doesn't completely send you out of control, then the Brutus isn't really going to be that great in my opinion. Uh, that is, until someone finds out something about the van that makes it totally unparalleled in an Arena Wars battle, and then everyone's like, Ugh, Pyrom, always hating on the best vehicles in the game. He didn't test it properly and now I'm going to unsubscribe. But I haven't gone over the other thing that the Brutus can do, which may or may not make it a seller for you. If you're bored and have a bunch of friends nearby you, call it in and you can do this. <coughs> Simply jump just before you reach the saw blades and away you go. If you jump too early or too late, then uh, yeah, you're gonna you're gonna get chopped up. <coughs> I've also been told that this will also send bikes flying if they charge straight towards it, so if the Brutus ultimately doesn't end up being a practical vehicle in the long run, at least you have a fun toy to play around with with your mate until it gets patched 5 months down the line. So let me know what you guys think about the Brutus. Are you going to buy one? Is it actually really good and I'm just full of nonsense? Let me know in the comments and hey, if you enjoyed this short video, make sure to leave a like and subscribe to the channel for loads more videos coming to you very soon. See you around folks.